This is your homework helper, Mrs. Anderson. Today I will help you with Lesson 5, Classify Quadrilaterals. Please have your homework page ready and let's begin. All right, as we come down here to the practice, we're going to describe the attributes of each quadrilateral and then classify the quadrilateral. So here in the homework helper, it shows the exact same thing that you're going to do in the practice. So this one, looking at this one, we can see that the quadrilateral has all sides congruent, all of the sides are congruent, and it has opposite, par um, opposite sides that are parallel, it has four right angles, so it is a square. So you're going to do the same thing on this one. You're going to write down the attributes. Well, one attribute that I can see is there are opposite parallel lines. So you'll write down opposite parallel lines, but you only have one set, okay? This one here and this one are not parallel, so that tells us it can't be a parallelogram, okay? You also have, uh, okay, in this one, so we could write that down that this one is a trapezoid. Okay, when we look at this one, I can see that I have opposite parallel lines, um, opposite parallel sides, I also have congruent sides, opposite sides. This side and this side are the exact same. And I also have um, four right angles. Okay, so then I write down the name of that quadrilateral. Let's look at number three. Circle the quadrilaterals that have all the attributes of a rectangle. So we just barely did one that was a rectangle. So all of the attributes that are here uh, if this um, if this quadrilateral matches this, then you will circle it. Okay, so a trapezoid, it's not going to match because it doesn't have two sets of parallel sides. Okay, but then you're going to read the definition, read your um, attributes here, and if they agree, if they match, then circle it. Okay, let's look at the back. Name all the quadrilaterals that have the given attributes. Okay, so which quadrilaterals have opposite sides parallel? Well, I know that a square does. I know that a rectangle does. I know that a rhombus does, and a parallelogram, and a trapezoid. So I'm gonna write all of those down. Okay, which quadrilaterals have four right angles? You write those down. Which ones have exactly one pair of opposite sides parallel? Oh, only one pair of op opposite sides is going to be our trapezoid and four congruent sides. Go ahead and write those down. Then you're going to write a real world problem that involves classifying a quadrilateral and then solve the problem. Okay, so you might um, think of the shape of a building and then describe what like the front of a building looks like or the roof of the building and then you um, write down what the quadrilateral is. Okay, let's move on. Fill in each blank with the correct term or number to complete each sentence. A rectangle is a parallelogram with how many right angles? A trapezoid is a quadrilateral with exactly how many pair of parallel sides? Okay, and here's a test practice. Which statement about the figures below is true? A, figure K and N are rectangles. Figures L and N are quadrilaterals. Figures K and N are parallelograms. Figure M and M are parallelograms, so you'll choose the correct one. Thanks for watching this homework helper video. If you have questions, feel free to ask me tomorrow at school.